Hello there, hello. So this is a video for anyone who is an Australian citizen. Okay, so if you're an Australian citizen and you want to get your degree certificate legalized, you follow the information that I've already given. So you either get it legalized in your home country first, and, uh, and then you get it legalized in Thailand at the Department of Consular Affairs, which is in Laxey um, in the north of Bangkok. Now, if you decide to get your document legalized in Australia, you will need to get the last stamp, the most important stamp, which is the Thai Embassy stamp. So the Thai Embassy certify that the degree is, is legalized in Australia. OK, and before that, you'll have to get um, it legalized by the Australian government or whatever way you get a document legalized in Australia. So that's the first point is remember that you need to have the degree legalized by the Thai embassy before you bring it to Thailand. Or you can do this, okay? So if you don't get your degree certificate legalized in Australia, um, you come to the Thailand Australian Embassy, okay? Australian Embassy Thailand website. Um, and you'll notice there's a list of, uh, you, you type in, I think I typed in like, uh, Australian Embassy, Oath Bangkok, and then I clicked on this and it came up with the exact page. Um, and basically what you're looking to do is you're certifying copies of original documents, okay? So that would be basically your degree certificate. You're certifying a copy. Um, so then the Australian Embassy in Thailand will give you the stamp for your degree certificate and you take that to the north of Bangkok, to the Department of Consular Affairs, to Laxey, okay, and then they'll give you the last stamp. So that la very last stamp that is needed for Thailand immigration. So Laxey is the most important signature. You either take your Thai Embassy, uh, Australian Thai Embassy um, degree certificate, which has been legalized, to Laxey and get that last stamp. Then you can go to immigration um, and get the do the, the work permit, uh, the um, not work permit, sorry, it's uh, visa and <laughs> do the visa process um, uh, or you don't get your degree legalized in Australia you take your degree to Bangkok and you book an appointment because it says here you have to book an appointment okay uh, with the Australian Embassy Thailand to get a certified copy of your degree now if you have a different name to your degree certificate and your passport um, then what you need to do is you need to also do an affidavit oath or affirmation to say that you are the same person as on your passport as on your degree okay so you will also have to book a separate appointment to make a, an oath which is a document okay that basically says that this degree and this passport belongs to me and it's it's both mine even though the names are separate once you've made that oath you take that document to laxi with your degree certificate that's been legalized as well, or with your degree certificate that has been certified as a copy, okay? And uh, you take both those documents to Laxi and they will legalize both of them for use in Thailand. Okay, so you'll have a legalized oath and you'll also have a legalized degree. And you can take both those documents to Thailand Immigration and they will do the visa process for you. Um, but your agency or school will help you with that process. This process you need to do um, mostly by yourself, but your school will know about it, your, your agency will know about it. So I'm just letting you know about this because if you're Australian, you need to book your appointment. And uh, that means that you need to click on this and basically book. So choose the correct one. So it's going to be documents for use in Thailand. And then you'd choose this one for your certifying your copy of your degree. And you choose this one for the oath or affidavit uh, or oath, oath affirmation affidavit. Now, I think you'll probably be able to do both at the same time. I don't think you need to choose two appointments, um, but I'm just going to click on oath affidavit. affidavit. Um, and then I'm going to go for the 2nd of October the 2nd. And I'm going to go, I'll get up early in the morning. There you go. And you put your details in, continue, and there you go. You've booked your appointment. So um, one thing that I don't want you to do is book an appointment on the 5th. Do not book an appointment on the 5th because the 5th of October is our um, 
our special welcome day event. So please do not book it on the 5th, but you will need to book it early. I would suggest booking it now. If you're going to do this, if you're not legalizing degree in Australia, then you'll need to legalize it only in Thailand through the Thailand embassy, the Thailand Australian embassy, um, and then the Department of Consular Affairs. And just so you know what the Department of Consular Affairs is, I'll just add this on, Department of Consular Affairs, uh, Bangkok. And uh, let me just check this. Uh, I think this might be it. I'll have, I'll have a look. Third Division, Chiang Wata. Now that's correct as well. Consular. So this is the map. And I think we'll go to that. I'll click on that website and we'll click on that map. Let's have a look. Mm -hmm, this is translated for me. Uh, fill out a legalization application form. Yeah, this is correct. This is correct. Let's have a look here. That is not correct. And this is the main website. So consular department service actually document legalization. Click on that and it should come up with this one. Document legalization. Huh. Okay. Which is in Thai. So make sure you get this one because <laughs> this one's not in Thai. All right. Uh, there's the application form there. Let me just have a look. Hmm. Form. Looks like they've not updated the website for a while. So you just have to go there in person anyway. So here it is, Department of Consular Affairs. Should be in Laxi. See Laxi there? Laxi. Um, and just to let you know how far away it is from, um, like, for example, the Welcome Day. It's quite far away from me. Hip Hotel. That's where the Welcome Day is going to be. 21-minute uh, drive. Okay, so just so you know where that is. Um, but yeah, so that's how you do it. If you're Australian, you need to book an appointment. That is the main purpose of this video. Thanks, guys.